How's everybody doing? Uh, I wanted to make this video. Um, this is a video about T-Mobile. Uh, and maybe some other companies too, but I know about T-Mobile because it's what I have. Um, okay, so we're going to talk about upgrading your phone and these new cool phones out. You know, oh, the Galaxy S4. Oh, the iPod. Oh, this and that. Okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to warn you because I got, I got taken. Okay, I got taken. All right, I didn't realize, but now I can warn everybody else so you guys don't get taken. And if you want to get taken, then get taken. It's up to you. It's just your choice if you want to brand a phone. So, here's an old T-Mobile phone. This is an old phone. This is a 4G, okay? Now, the SIM card looks like this. It's just a regular SIM card. This is how they always look. This is how I'm used to seeing a SIM card. All right? Nowadays, they got what's called 4G LTE. All right? It's a different... It's a different band. It's all different. The chip is tiny. The chip doesn't look like this. It's small. It's like half of this. All right. Now, let me tell you a little few secrets if you have T-Mobile. I'll tell you some secrets about some of the things that you can do that T-Mobile knows about and has stopped with the new phones like the S4 and all the other new ones that have the LTE. If you want LTE, you're going to lose this. And I'm going to tell you what you're going to lose. Now, Wi-Fi, when you have internet, which I have unlimited internet on this phone, on, on, on my, I had it on this old phone when, before I got the new one, um, I could connect my Wi-Fi to any, any of my devices in my house for free. And they, they would try to charge me. They would try to, a little message would come up on my phone. Oh, you can't do this. You can't do this. You know, try, you know, like Nazis, you know, you can't do this. You can't do this. You have to pay us. And they couldn't stop it. You can't stop the 4G from doing that. But... Okay, if you know this already, which you know, again, a lot of people don't know. Try it if you have a T-Mobile phone. You can, you can, you can do other phones. I've done my laptop, and it's, it's, it's just you can do it, and it, it cannot stop you. If you get a brand new phone with the LTE, they're gonna stop you because what they did is they changed the chip. The chip is smaller. It's a, again, it's a new system, and on the Wi-Fi, they have it now. You have to now you have to pay for it because they have a. Uh, a program now it's it's uh you pay for it and and, and if you go to the sit to, to the settings in this phone my phone or your new phone if you did it and if you have lte go to the settings and try to do wi-fi click on put it on turn it on it says you have to have an account with us and it costs it's like 10 20 bucks a month you know what i mean and, and again he tried to offer me a ten dollar thing ten dollars a month and you only get four gigabytes it's not even worth it you know what i mean you can just you know, don't even sweat it. Just get regular internet in your house or something and get a router or something. But, you know, they are now are cracking down on these old phones, which can do unlimited Wi-Fi. So these phones, a lot of people don't know. These, you know, you, you can sell them for a pretty penny, too, because of, of that feature. A lot of people don't know that feature. This is just a Galaxy S. It's just a regular old Galaxy S. But the features of these old 4G phones are priceless. So if you're willing to lose that one feat, that's basically a feature you're gonna lose. And the fact that, you know, you know, it's just a different system, uh, a lot of different things uh, that have changed, a little bit different things that have changed, you know, they're new and, you know, you know, just GPS, like the, the other one has GPS, but this just has more stuff to try to like, like bother you with questions and stuff like that. It's just like, now they're like, they're being more like Nazis. Now, they're trying to control, they want to control the game now. So they both they bring out these cool phones, but they don't tell you that the chip would no longer be used. This chip is it's different. It's a smaller chip, and they will take you because they want to, they will not tell you that you won't be able to do that. Once you lose that Wi-Fi, if, if it's something that you used before, you're going to lose it. And uh, there's a few other things. What's the other thing that you lose on that phone? Um... There's just a few things I don't like about the new phone. I mean, it's fast, you know. I mean, you can download stuff and all that. But there's just a few, a few things that just I don't like about it. That's one of the things I don't like about it. Other than that, it's not a bad phone. You know what I mean? It's not that bad. But um, yeah, that's just one of the things. The Wi-Fi thing, the Wi-Fi sharing. You cannot. It's, just, it's gone. They're taking that from you. You won't have Wi-Fi sharing ever again for free Wi-Fi. Free Wi-Fi. So you, if you have a Wii or you have a Xbox or something, you can use your Wi-Fi from your old 4G to power that. I've done it. And it works, and they cannot stop you. No matter what message comes up, you cannot be stopped. Now, they have stopped you. They have, the Gestapo has put a hold on it. Yeah. So, there you go. But, just to warn you, before you go get that phone, you might want to think about keeping your old one. Take care. God bless.